Okay, so this is market forces and government intervention, which is section eight of the course. Okay, so the price mechanism has four main functions. It is the allocative function, it has the uh, signaling function, incentive in function, and rationing in function from there. So whenever you talk about the price mechanism, you need to talk about all these different functions on here. So if prices rise because there's a shortage of the product, e.g. sand, then people will use less of it. The signaling function is that prices provide uh, important market signals to producers to produce more of that particular type of good. The incentive function, obviously, if prices go up, firms are going to make more profits. If they make more profits, then they move into that area. The additive function is, is putting uh, your resources into areas where they're going to have the most impact, where, in fact, price is equal to marginal cost as well. So we have market forces. Market forces uh, work in this way, but we can also remember use taxes and subsidies, negative consumption tax and anti diagram, etc., etc., carbon taxes, pollution permits to push firms into the right sort of direction. And that is the question of the government changing the pattern of demand. And also we have a command and control technique, which is regulation, which is a quick way of doing something from there. Okay.